All right, legends, it's Hato here from the Real Australian Dream, and today I'm giving you guys a review on the Point Quabba Blowhole Campground, mate. Check this out behind me, she's about to erupt. I am absolutely saturated trying to film this intro, but mate, it is something that you've got to see to believe. The sound of it, the veracity, it's just absolutely amazing. Something I've never ever seen before, and mate, something I'll never forget. Check out that behind me. What a bloody spectacular sight. Anyway, let's go have a geese. All right, g'day Dream Team, it's Hato here and we are at camp. We have found a little spot tucked away behind the dunes at Point Quabba Blowholes Campground and mate, She's a very, very interesting vibe here, let me tell you. This place, it's only gonna cost you 11 bucks per night, per person, and mate, look, it's not the most picturesque bloody campground you've ever seen, but it's certainly quirky, certainly interesting. I've got the leader expedition, as always, and we're tucked in behind the dunes because there's a bit of wind getting around. One of the most intriguing parts of this place is that there is these little shacks littered around the, around the campground. There must be 40, 50, 60 of them and uh, it's very, very unusual because they're very quite run down. Uh, yeah, they're not in good shape, but, uh, but apparently they're fishing shacks. People have, um, people have them, they come here, they use them um, for their weekends away or whatever. Uh, but very interesting vibe here, I gotta say, a very unique experience. In terms, of, uh, in terms of the campground itself, there's no booking system. First in, best dressed, we're here in October, uh, November. Um, so it's quite quiet, so there's plenty of spots around. Uh, but essentially, you drive around, find your spot, uh, and then the caretaker will come around at some point and, uh, and make sure you pay online uh, from there. Internet service is available, so there's reception, both Telstra uh, and Optus, I believe. Uh, so you can do that online, stay connected, do your phone calls and, uh, and whatever you need there. Now, in terms of things to do, there's a beach boat ramp here. Apparently, the fishing is really, really good. We're only here for a couple of days, so we're not gonna test that one out but there's an amazing snorkeling spot we're gonna take you to today. Uh, and then there's of course the world famous, as you saw at the start of the video, the Quabba blowholes, mate, let me tell you. They are just a, a sight to be seen, absolutely phenomenal. And then of course you've got the big King Waves Kill sign, which is a, uh, a must do photo opportunity. Uh, and as far as I'm concerned, you didn't even come to Quabba if you didn't get a photo of that sign. Anyway, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Don't forget to share, like, subscribe to our channel and uh and we'll uh, go have a bit of a gaze and have a bit more of a look around enjoy